In this lecture we're going to look at setting up a VM, creating a VM actually in VMware vCenter 6.7. So you can go to your vCenter, you can go to VMs, and then you can go to Actions and just click on, no actually you need to be in the host, excuse me. So you click on the host, you go to VMs, you click on Actions, you go New Virtual Machine. So to create a new virtual machine, I'm going to click Next. We're going to name our virtual machine and we're going to select a location for the virtual machine. This is the data store. Uh, I'm sorry, data center. We're going to click uh, next. We're going to choose a location of the, um, the, the VM actually. We're going to choose it in 31. That's the ESXi host. Click next. Choose the data store. Uh, we're going to choose the open filer and click Next. And then Compatibility. It's going to be ESXi 6.7 or later. Click Next. Okay, so the Windows OS is actually a Linux and it's a Ubuntu. Oh, that's neat. F VMware Photon. That's kind of cool. So it's Ubuntu. Where's Ubuntu at? Is it even listed in here? CentOS. Okay, other Linux 64-bit. That's fine. Uh, not fully supported. Okay, let's choose another one. Let's go other, other. Let's do other Linux 64. That's good. Uh, okay, click next. So, a couple different things. One CPU, um, gig or mem not not gig, lower than that probably. It's Linux, so we'll go 512 mega RAM. A new hard disk, we'll change it to um, thin, thin client, thin provision, if you will, not thick. 16 gig is fine, thin provision, right? So the network is VMware. Uh, the CD is actually in, it's actually in a host file, so that's host. The file is in that should actually be should data store actually so data store so I think it's data store there it is right there tiny core current click OK yeah that's fine yep conduct as power on right okay it takes care of our ISO file video card other that's fine click Next, what's this VM's options? Uh, yeah, we're fine there. So click next and finally finish. Okay, after that is done, click on the actual Ubuntu Linux itself. You can click it, double click it here. And once you power it on, you're ready to install the OS. So thanks for viewing this tutorial on how to set up a VM and VMware on ESXi 6.7. If you like this video and you want to see more, please jump on to my course, which is, I have two courses. One is at getajobnit.teachable.com and the other course is on Udemy. It's learn backup and restore with Commvault, get a high paying job. You can also subscribe to my YouTube channel just type in Gary McNeely or Commvault Whisperer. There's some good content there related to this. If you would, could you click on the subscribe button and click on notifications? Thank you very much.